Imagine earning a staggering $1.20k a month by simply re-uploading movies. It sounds too good to be true, right? But hold on, because today I'm going to reveal mind-blowing AI tricks that will change your YouTube game forever. Get ready for a step-by-step -step guide on how to upload movies on YouTube without copyright claims. We can't upload movies on YouTube directly, but we can make a channel like this. So what is he doing? He is just uploading movie clips, and he explains the whole movie in his video by adding a voiceover. As you can see, his channel is monetized. It means you can upload movies without any copyright issues, but with a smart trick. And in this video, I will completely guide you that how you can create a channel like this. Just follow all the steps that I will tell you. But first of all, see his earnings. Almost $50,000 he earned on the base of ad revenue and is an insane amount. Now, we will create a similar channel like this. So first of all, we need a movie. Download your favorite movie from the internet and save it to your laptop. In my case, I already downloaded John Wick Chapter 4 movie. Do not publish a complete movie. If you do that, YouTube will remove your video or maybe it can remove your channel. Now we need a script. Here I generated three ways of script writing for you. You can choose any of them the first method of script writing is chat GPT. Give him a prompt that write the full explanation of a movie, for example, Jack and the Giant Slayer, and it will start generating a full script for you. But this method will not work on all movies because chat GPT only has the data before 2021 movies. It has no data on the latest movies like John Wick chapter four. So what we will do, now move on to method number two. This method is very simple. If you are a movie lover, then watch the complete movie first and then explain the whole movie in your own words. But remember, keep the length of your video around 10 to 15. For this purpose, write a script first in the word file. Write your point of view after watching the movie in the script. And now just record your voice after editing clips from any movie. Method number three of script writing is through IMDb. Now I open Google and type here John Wick Chapter 4. Go on this site. IMDB is an online database of information related to films, television series, podcasts, home videos, and video game. Now scroll down and find here the storyline section. Click on Plot Synopsis. See here the complete story of the movie. You can take an idea about the movie or you can use this synopsis into your video's explanation script. Do not directly copy or paste this whole paragraph. Keep some changes in them or you can rephrase the whole article. Here, our first step is completed. Step number two is voiceover. Record your voice if you can, but if your voice quality is not good, then you can use an AI voiceover. For this purpose, go to 11 labs and put your whole script here. It will generate the whole script for you. But remember, always use human sounding like voiceovers in any AI tool. Your selected voice not looking like a robotic tune in listening. Because YouTube can reject your monetization because of bad robotic voiceovers. The next step is video editing, which is the most critical step if you plan to make a channel in this niche. Because if your editing is not good, YouTube can send you to a copyright strike. So keep watching the whole tutorial. Open any editor I'm using, Filmora 12. You can use it in video. Now paste your movie here. Keep in mind to remove the movie's original sound. It is a very necessary part. Then take some short few seconds clips from the movie. Cut the movie from every 8 to 10 seconds and convert it into a short clip. Do not use any long clip more than 10 seconds. Just convert your whole movie into short clips, as per your script wording. Now paste your script voice over here and blue the movie clips. Complete your editing. Now this will become your content because you added voice over and removed the original audio of the movie. Now just save it on your laptop. The next step is thumbnail. If you check this channel, you can see he is using just some scenes from the movie and use them as thumbnails. So watch the complete movie and catch the highly engaging scene from a movie. Take the screen short and edit it if you want to add some elements to it. For example, in my case, I like this scene from John Wick 4 movie. I just take the screenshot by pressing. These keys are from my laptop's keypad. Now open Canva.com. It is a free graphic designing tool. Now select the YouTube thumbnail and press enter. Open this page and upload your screenshot here. Adjust the size of the image. And now add some elements for making your thumbnail more engaging. But remember, do not add several elements in your thumbnail. Always use fewer words 
and fewer elements in the thumbnail to make it more suspenseful. I already uploaded a video on how to make high clickable thumbnails. You can watch it for gaining knowledge about thumbnail making strategy. Our last step is publishing. Go on YouTube and publish your video. Now we will set out the video's title, tags, and description. Go on ChatGPT and right here. Generate the best eye-catchy title for my YouTube video that is about John Wick Chapter 4 Full Explanation in English. Now select the title. I like this one. Just copy and paste it into the title section. Then move back on ChatGPT and give him the command to write a short description for my YouTube channel on this title. Now wait for some seconds and here your description is ready. Copy it and paste it into the description section. Upload your thumbnail here that you, that you created from Canva.com. Next is the tag section. Move back on chat GPT and right here. Give me some relevant tags according to my video's title. Moreover, you can use the YouTube search bar and vidIQ tool for generating keywords for your video. Now just paste all the tags in the tag section and then select video language and complete the other elements that are up to you. See, there is no copyright issue here. YouTube detects copyright content here, but our content is not copyrighted at all. So this is all about the video. I hope you like it. If you like, then please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. I will meet you in the next video. Thank you. You can watch the video showing on your screen right now to learn how you can create real-life mockups for your designs with Canva. See you there.